all right so in this video we will have a look at how to change or see all the passwords the network share passwords that you have saved on your windows machine so um, you might remember that sometimes when you're trying to access a shared drive or something which is on a different system on your network or which is on a shared driver like a network access storage nas or a hard drive connected to your router or something it prompts you for a password and then when you say add this particular password save this particular password um, it saves it somewhere so where exactly is that somewhere how can you see that place uh, where all these credentials are saved so that's what I'm gonna show you today so one way to uh, access that particular utility where uh, all these credentials are saved is to open the run menu um, for that you can just go to start and type run or you can also press window key and R and then type in control and then key mgr dot dll and then press enter so this thing allows you to access credential manager so this is uh, the tool the utility that manages all uh, the credentials that are saved on your Windows system you can see over here Windows credentials and if you are using any certificate based credentials or any other generic credentials and so on so um, obviously one more way to access it is okay, let me close this and show it to you is that you go to control panel and over here um, just search for credential manager there you go and it takes you exactly to the same place now they, this is where the list of all the credentials are visible um, so you can either access them um, you can remove them you can make changes to them if you want to change a particular credential you can change it from here if you want to add a new credential you can also add a new credential so say for example if I want to add a new credential for a machine that I have on my network um, say it's my laptop so if I want to say the underscore laptop and um, my username is deep and my password I'll just type in my password okay so there you go now when I access my laptop um, it should not prompt me for credentials because the credentials are already there um, in the vault let's go ahead and try removing this credential now so if I click on remove um, it prompts me are you sure you permanently you want you want to permanently delete this Windows credential uh, I would say yes and it would delete it now what if you want to back up your vault so say for example you have a series of credentials several uh, network credentials saved on your Windows machine and you want to back it up somewhere so that if you happen to change your machine or if you are upgrading your machine or making any major maintenance to your machine like switching the hard disk or something then in case if these get lost you can restore them you can retrieve them back so for that you can use the backup vault utility now as I click on backup vault it asks me where do I want to back it up so I'm going to say on desktop and I'm going to name it uh, my vault and just save it now as I press next it will prompt me to press ctrl alt or delete so it says press ctrl alt or delete to continue your backup on the secure desktop let me press ctrl alt or delete okay it's now asking my password I'm not sure if you can see the screen it's now asking me for a password to protect the backup file um, so I'm just going to type my password and there you go it says the backup was successful alright so that's how you basically backup um, Windows credentials now the same way if you want to restore you can just click on restore and follow through the process and that will help you restore back the credentials um, it's quite uh, simple and straightforward I just wanted you to uh, be aware of this particular utility called credential manager that is available um, if you even google you'll find more information on it but I thought I'll just create a basic awareness video so that if you guys are wondering out there where these credentials are saved and what if you want to delete them so what if you by mistake save credentials on a machine that that is in your machine and you're just accessing it so say for example if you are in an office you're accessing your own machine 
through someone else's machine maybe via mstsc remote desktop connection and you by mistake happen to save your password there and what if you want to delete this password this is how you can do it so that was it for this particular video guys thanks a lot for watching and do like and share this video uh, do subscribe okay i'm just gonna i'm sorry for this prompt uh, do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already subscribed and if you have any comments any suggestions please feel free to drop them in in the comment section below this video thanks a lot again for watching and stay tuned for more